What was Teddy Roosevelt's reaction to getting shot in the chest? On October 14, 1912, former saloon keeper John Fleming Schrank attempted to assassinate former U.S. President Theodore Roosevelt. Schrank's bullet lodged in Roosevelt's chest after penetrating Roosevelt's steel eyeglass case and passing through a thick, single-folded copy of the speech titled, Progressive Cause Greater Than Any Individual, which he was carrying in his jacket. Roosevelt correctly concluded that since he was not coughing blood, the bullet had not reached his lung. Subsequent x-rays showed that the bullet had lodged in Roosevelt's chest muscle, but did not penetrate the pleura, as doctors concluded that it would be less dangerous to leave it in place than to attempt to remove it. Roosevelt carried the bullet with him for the rest of his life. Determined to deliver his scheduled speech, Roosevelt declined suggestions to go to the hospital immediately. His opening comments to the gathered crowd were, Friends, I shall ask you to be as quiet as possible. I don't know whether you fully understand that I have just been shot, but it takes more than that to kill a bull moose.